Okay, so here we are with the final part, which means results. So in this part, we are going to show the results. As you know, the best solution obtained recently uh, stored in G particle. So in order to show the best solution, which means the positions, the best positions obtained in each iteration, we are going to uh, um, store it in G particle that pose. So here we show it using name to string. We can use it display uh, in the set in the same line of the what we want to write and what the answer we obtained to be shown in just one line. And the best fitness is going to be shown uh, using G particle dot cast and talk as I told you previously. Uh, as I told you before, uh, the time elapsed in order to execute the uh, um, the, uh, the the program is going to be shown here. Now, and after that, the best answers in each, in each iteration has been stored in best. So we are going to plot it, uh, and uh, let's see how this algorithm works. Um, let's see. The, as you can see here. As the uh, problem we have defined is so simple, as you know, the first, second iteration, and the, at the sixth iteration, it has re it has reached the best answer, and later on, just the answer is like this. Um, so this was all about PSO algorithm. Do not hesitate to ask your question to send us email. Uh, so here is uh, Matlab for students team. Have a good time. Bye.